General Mathematics is brought to you by The Math Teacher. Which of the following equations represent a relation and which represent a function? And here's the answer to previous questions. All are relations. Most are functions, except number 2 and number 4. Why? Because we can find an x value that corresponds to more than one y value. What is the domain and the range of a relation or a function? The domain of a relation or a function is the set of all the possible values the variable x can take. The range is the set of the y values. If a relation is a function, then y can be replaced by f of x. If y is replaced by f of x, then the following relations are now called functions. Evaluating functions. Evaluating a function means replacing a variable in the function, in this case, x with the value, from the function's domain, and computing for the result. To denote that we are evaluating f at x, for some x, in the domain of a function f, we write f of x. Let us take example 1, evaluate the following functions at x equals 1.5. Example 2, find g of negative 4 and h of 1, where g of x and h of x are as defined in the previous example. Note that, 1, is not a possible domain of the function h of x equals 2x plus 1 over x minus 1 because the resulting range is undefined. Example 3, where f of x and g of x are as defined in the previous example. Given that f of x equals 2x plus 1 and g of x equals x squared minus 2x plus 2, evaluate the following functions. And here's the solution. To evaluate f of 3x plus 1, replace all the x in f of x equals 2x plus 1 by 3x plus 1. And to evaluate g of 2x plus 3, replace all the x in g of x equals x squared minus 2x plus 2 by 2x plus 3. And for your tasks, perform seat work number 1. Likewise, seat work number 2 will follow.